So off the tip, it's two. Allen's checked in for Jackson. So Team World's five right now. Brooks is out there with Nilakina. Then there's Markinen. And it's Tice in at center. And now we'll go to David Aldridge, who spoke with Steve Kerr. David. He talked about his roster of players for the Rising Stars Challenge. He said, I look at this group from top to bottom and think to myself that these will be the faces of the NBA in just a few years. Each and every one of them has a lot of talent and a chance to be truly dominant in this league. Well, Kevin, we'll see if his prediction can come true. Back to you. Thank you, David. Great quarter for him at the offensive end, trying to will his team back in the game. To the middle. Here's Allen. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Yeah, they're lasered in. I mean, really making the most of their possessions. Here's Nilakina. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. To the inside. Markinen, offensive rebound. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Team World trails by six. Here's Neela Kina, hands it from downtown. Neela Kina's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Man, good to see Neela Kina square up from deep, has the size and touch needed to knock home these threes. Tatum's shot is off. On offense, here's Team World. Osman kicks to Neely Kina. Here's Tice, defended by Carter. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Neely Kina. Gets the front of the rim and out. And as he squares up for mid-range, the defender right in his face. Yeah, I like the fact, Greg, that he crowded the shooter there, made him uncomfortable, got into his airspace a bit. Looked like he forced the shot. Here's Nilakina. Jason Tatum picking up that last basket. Shot, high post. Carter pulls it in. And this quarter, he has clearly been off the mark. Here's Allen. And the bucket counts. Three-point chance here. Big group substitution here for Team USA. Allen's checked in for Carter. Porter comes in for Tatum. Smith checked in for Bridges. And De'Aaron Fox subbed in for Young. Team World trails by eight. Pass to Musa. Here's Yabusele. Knocked loose. It's taken away by Smith. Here's Allen. Kicks it out to Allen. Some nice ball movement by Team USA. Allen passes to Porter. Fouled in the act of shooting. A three-point play chance coming up. In this first period, they've been aggressive and extremely focused. Yeah, this is a big lead right now, a big one. And they've seized momentum and showing no signs of letting it go. And the ceiling so high for Porter. A versatile, effective forward who does so many things well. And now the first time out called here for Team World. Yeah, the amount of points they've given up here in the paint, that, that's what they've got to talk about. Absolutely, Greg. I mean, they're getting crushed, killed, hammered, pulverized in the post. Here's Yabusele. Okobo. And that one hits back iron. Allen finds Smith. Drives it from nine. Allen shot is off. Team World trails by 11. Here's Korkmaz. Porter with the steal. And now Team USA on the break. That's good from Allen on the assist from Porter. And it's nine points for Allen. And an important part of every team's game. A look at the hustle stats for Team USA. Boy, they've really amped up the pressure at the defensive end, guys, and have piled up the steals in the early going. And also, how about the fact defensively they're getting that backboard and getting out in transition, especially in this first half. And it's Team World with the ball after the made shot from Allen. Okobo, guarded by Fox. 
four on the shot clock. Here's Yamu Sele. And they've done a nice job controlling the defensive backboard to start this game. Not one second chance bucket allowed. That is finishing off good defense. And already with the commanding lead, a terrific offensive performance. Yeah, and the execution, time and time again, right on point. They're running their offense to perfection. Here's Yabu Shele. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game for him. Corkmans banked in off the glass. That's just too easy. I mean, you can't let him post you like that. Yeah, where's your fight? You got to show more fight than that. There's 31 seconds left to play here in the first. Smith outside. Fires the three. Traps in the tray. And Team USA leads by 16. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. Well, everything's coming too easily. I mean, at some point, defensively, defensively you have to take something away. Musa. Three pointer. No good that time. The first quarter concludes in a double digit lead on the. <laughs> team swap here for Team USA. Team World making some changes. They've got Young. Jason Tatum is out there with Allen. Then there's Carter. And it's Bridges in at the two spot. So that's the five in the game for Team USA. Markin and inside the line. Releases from the wing and drills it. Markinen's got 14. You know, if you're only looking at the way he's played offensively, you'd think his team would have the lead. Shots good from Young. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of them. Here's Osman, guarded by Tatum. Pass to Nilekina. And the pass to Brooks. Here's Osman, guarded by Tatum. And it's Osman missing. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one, Greg. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. And some guys just have a nose for scoring. And this one couldn't have been any easier. Yeah, that was actually no defense at all there, Greg. I mean, layups don't come any easier than that. I mean, they're piling it on now. Now, here's Bridges. Lowry Markinen unable to get his last shot to go. Tries again. Got a piece of it. And that's evidence that Markinen is working on his defense, and it's critical that he does so. And blocks like this show he's making good strike. And the shot goes in. And not a great start for him in the first, but he's quickly starting to turn it around. And Young kicks to Bridges. Pass to Allen. Shoots over Markinen. That's good from Allen on the assist by Bridges. 15 points for Allen. It, it goes down, but with no defender near him, no need to go to the fadeaway. Neely Kina passes to Tice. Brooks against Carter. Pass to Osman. Good ball movement here by Team World. Let's it go from 11. And Allen with the block. And it's out of bounds. Team World will retain possession. One fifty six left in the first half and this has really become a struggle for them. Their, their shots aren't dropping and it's reflected on the scoreboard. They, they need to put everything they have into getting high percentage shots. Here's Neil Aquino. Eight points for him. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah a cold stretch offensively for sure. Passes it to Osman. Back to Markinen. Off target from outside. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Oh, great ball movement there. Yabu Sele, he's checked in for Team World. Team USA have gone three of four at the free throw line tonight. 114 left in the first half. 
Here's Nilakina, defended by Young. Will it go? Rejected by Young. You know, solid instincts defensively. Young showing a real desire to compete on that side of the ball. He kicks to Bridges. Here's Allen. Off the left rim and out. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that. Yeah, I like the feel Neely Kena showed there. I mean, nice sense of where he was and what was available. Brooks has gone three for three from the floor. With the floater, and Young with the nice bucket inside. Young's got ten points in the quarter. Well, I like the first quarter he had. I mean, and I'm loving the second quarter even more. Playing with a lot of momentum right now. Pushing it up. Here's Allen. And so he earns a trip to the line. Official saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots of the game right here. Free throw, good, Allen. And no secret here, this is what you need to do with the lead. Hit your free throws, and they're having a great second quarter at the line. Fox, he's checked in for Bridges. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Okobo, defended by Young. The pass to Yabusele. Here's Nader. Clock at six. Okobo. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. And so it's Team USA. Third quarter just about to get going here in what has been so far a runaway. And look at how the hustle game has been going for Team USA. Well, it's been an outstanding game for them in the open court. Their fast break points really stand out. Yeah, and another thing, they, they've created a lot of turnovers, but they've also been able to convert when they've gotten down in transition. And I tell you, the versatility of marketing makes you salivate, guys. A big guy with range for days, and I think he's only going to get better and better. So, Team World's five right now. Abusele out there with Quirk Mods. Then it's Lowry Markinen, and it's Musa in at the shooting guard. Allen, good, and a nice assist from Fox. <laughs> Fox has got his fourth assist in this one. And he can take over in a nanosecond. I mean, once he catches fire, it's difficult to squelch it. Two open that time made it look too easy. Korkmaz has got five. Tell you what, it does not matter who's shooting. The defense has got to be better at getting a hand up on long-range shooters. You've got to challenge the shot. Here's Allen. And Team USA getting another basket right there. And that kind of sums up the defensive effort we've seen here tonight, guys. Musa passes to Markinen. Okobo. And it's off from three-point range. Musa can't hit. Oh, great effort there. That's how you defend the paint. Exactly. Can't play it any better than that, Greg. Ripped away. Here's Korkmaz, defended by Allen. And that one's good, Korkmaz. Korkmaz has got five points now in the quarter. And that's just a great individual play right through the teeth of the defense. Allen dishes to Smith. Allen left side. And it's Allen slamming it down. Yeah, and Smith doing a nice job getting his teammates involved. Terrific at spotting the open man. On offense, here's Team World. And there's the foul. It'll go on AI. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. For Team World, they haven't yet missed a free throw. Five for five. And Team World making a change here. Nader's checked in. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Yeah, you know what? And I think they've just got to keep on keeping on. Keep drawing contact, attacking, getting to the line. That will certainly give them a chance to get back into the game. And there's the foul. It'll go on AI. So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus. And we'll go to the line to shoot two. He makes one of two that time. 
Yeah, I like that they haven't lost their aggressiveness here in the second, despite being down. That's exactly when you need to be aggressive, Greg. You know that. I mean, another good job, though, of drawing contact and getting to the free throw line. Pass to Yabusele. Down low. There's the double team with Allen. Okobo. Got it. Good job in the low post. Just a late reaction there from the defense, and he is always going to finish that one. This could get even more out of hand if they continue to put up points. Wow, Kevin, what a performance we are seeing. Allen surveying the D. Some nice ball movement by Team USA. Team USA needs to get off a shot. Fox, no good. And it's Team World with the ball. 44 seconds left in the third quarter. Nader kicks to Markinen. Korkmaz passes to Markinen. Out to the wing. Okobo. It's good from long range. He's got five. He can be dangerous from outside. Sure, he didn't get one to go in the first, but we know he can get on a roll and knock him down. Here's Allen. Markinen pulls it in. Markinen's got four rebounds in this game. Pass to Korkmaz. Inside. Fox with the steal. Porter kicks to Allen. Watches the slam dunk finish. And fought hard to make his way to the rim, but give the D credit, did just enough to force him. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Uh, just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball, and how about the perfect delivery? And they'd love to see every possession in this way. True team basketball. And thanks again for joining us. Let's see what happens here in the fourth. Okay, now let's reset our lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go for this fourth quarter. And so in the game for Team USA. Allen is out there with Allen. Then it's Porter. And it's Fox. And it's Smith in at the shooting guard position. Fox with it. Outside, Porter. Kicks it to Allen. To the middle. There's Allen. That's good on the assist by Allen. Man, can you always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass? Money. Here's Korkmaz, covered by Smith. Mark, when you were playing to complement your inside game, you had that wonderful mid-range jumper, but more and more, players are going away from it. It's Team USA winning this one easily. What a terrific game. I tell you what, these young players are going to give us years of excitement to come. To... 